gonna give, I'm gonna give, I'm gonna give you all. After 14 years of knowing you, 13 years of dating you, nine years of living with you, four years of planning this day, <laughs> and a year and a half of marriage already, I'd say I'm ready to commit to you in front of our friends and family. <laughs> I can only begin to express how lucky I feel to be your wife, to have found you at such a young age, to have grown up alongside you, to have developed into our own unique individuals with so much in common. I realize that lucky doesn't even begin to cover it. You wake my heart to life. You shine like summer skies. You light up my darkest night. Alex's mom and I met Aaron about 13 years ago. Um, while they were still high school kids, um, we had instantly an attraction to Aaron. Um, she's just so easy to get along with, so likable, um, kind of a personality that nobody can't like. It's just so bubbly, so happy. Whenever I speak about you, I think, you know, well, it was like when the kids, you know, Alex and Aaron, and, and Adam growing up. So it seems like you've been a member of our family forever. So we're, we're very blessed to have that. It's over a decade later, and you're still making it spark. <laughs> but to reflect on how we got here, I'll bring it back to the start. <laughs> it was 2008. I made 2,000 mistakes. <laughs> but one thing I did right, is that I found you to date. <laughs> Brought together by fate, just as babies in high school, but came from different ones. I was super lucky to find you. Was our Euro trip after college in 2013. We were ready to explore the world for the first time together. We learned so much about each other on this trip and how to adapt as a couple. We learned that we both get hangry so we should always address hunger immediately before deciding what to do next. I love the creativity and spontaneity that you add to our life. You pour everything you have into what you do, and it continues to inspire me to be more thoughtful, to be more attentive, and more dependable for you. Back then, we were quite different people. You were a grade A, goody girl who drove a bright yellow beetle. <laughs> and on the other hand, well, let's just say the things I did weren't quite always legal. <laughs> but somehow, somehow you still gave that punk a chance. You gave me purpose and direction to become a good man.
You provide this perfect balance to what I am missing on my own, and you make me a better person. This past year and a half of marriage has been even better than I expected. We are a cohesive unit, the Nyes. We work through things, we problem solve together through work and life issues, and of course, at the rock gym. We are stronger, can dream better, and can handle anything better together than we can be ever alone. I vow to have patience and listen when we're both hangry or stressed. <laughs> I'll be there with massages and baby talk when you need to decompress. <laughs> I vow to be your biggest fan, lift you up, empower you. I promise to be honest and kind. I promise to choose you every day. I can say with 100% certainty that I am marrying my soulmate today. You will always be my best friend and my one true love. I love you with all my heart. You and me, kuna kilo piggy. <laughs> Man, that life sounds priceless. Because the places and the faces change. And no, we can't predict the weather. But no matter what life throws our way, I vow to take it on together. I love you. I now pronounce you husband and wife. And kiss the bride. This is Alex So I have no doubt that the two of you are going to continue to rock this life together. Aaron is really the perfect match for Alex and Alex for Aaron. They always make time for family and friends. As busy as they are, if you call them for anything they do. Raise your glasses, toast to Aaron and Alex. Cheers. Cheers.